Greetings everyone, Cord here, and it's time for another unboxing, and I got my DC Legion of Collectors box right here, and let's go ahead and get right into it, because I cannot wait, because now, you've probably seen it that they started uh, pretty much spoiling <laughs> uh, what, the box, what the exclusive pop is going to be inside each one of these boxes, so I already know. I mean, it's the de it's Batman the Animated Series. I already know it's Mr. Freeze, but seeing him in real life compared to the concept art is always something, you know, more incredible. And first thing, of course, to show off the box a little bit, you can see here. <laughs> uh, they've been really going with this, you know, original art style. But with this one, since it's not so much comic book based, it's more, you know, cartoon based from the early morning shows. They actually, I mean, they captured a lot of the detail and a lot of the look pretty well. And I do like the fact that it's the first three seasons and not the redesigns that they went with. So that's pretty cool uh, to see that for sure. Oops. Hitting my mic a little bit because we're out of space. Fix that real quick. <laughs> So first thing out of the box you can see is our patches, which is the Joker, which is really cool. I really like that. Uh, this is Joker Legion of Collectors right there on the bottom. So that's really cool. And it's got hit the playing cards behind him. Next we got a Catwoman pin, which I need to put that up here because it focuses better. <laughs> Which is really cool. I do like the this version of Catwoman, the gray and black. I always thought it was more stylized compared to some of the others. So I'll put these there. And next thing out of the box, we have our preview of what is to come for uh, two in two months, which is going to be DC Most Wanted. So it looks like it's going to be a lot of the bad guys, which should be pretty cool. If they got this bad boy in a pop that's gonna be pretty epic because I mean usually when they have these they usually kind of spoil what's gonna be in it you know if they do a six inch pop in one of these exclusives I think that would be really cool the DC hasn't done a six inch pop um, Marvel has they did it for their Hulkbuster which was the first one for the Avengers box if they do like a six inch pop for one of these guys or even Luther like in his uh, Superman suit and we'll go and hide that. That would be pretty cool. So first out of the box is the comic, which is oh nice. It's the Batman, uh, the Batman Adventures, which is the animated adventures. Uh, of course, it's got the. Let me take off the plastic on this so you can see it a little bit better. There we go. <laughs> which has the classic look of him, you know, overseeing Gotham. With the uh, Zeppelin in the background, the red skies, very Batman animated series, which is really cool. I believe this is a reprint. Yeah, because the Batman Adventures is the reprint of the first issue, which I always like that the reprints because then you get a lot of people that haven't seen, you know, the series or you know would have never thought of actually going this, you know, finding them, um, get some hooked back into it. And next we got the shirt, which. So you see, looks pretty epic. It might be my new favorite shirt. And let's go ahead and go to the better picture because you got Batman animated series pop version, <laughs> which is really cool. It's <coughs> excuse me. Uh, it's a pretty thick shirt. I believe this is the 100% cotton ones. Usually the 100% cotton are uh, thicker yes it is 100% cotton so it is a little thicker than some of the other shirts because they do like to go back and forth between the cotton and the polyester and you can see it's really cool oh man <laughs> it's it's subtle enough that you know it's a pop but also you know it's the animated series and we'll go ahead and put him right here for now so we keep an eye on him so he can keep he can keep an eye on us while we continue but what's in the box and this is a surprise there is a 
puck ride of Batman in his Batmobile. I was not expecting this. This is pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and get him out because I do. I'm definitely gonna have to find a place for him. Was not expecting something of this magnitude, of this scale. This box is nuts so far, and we haven't gotten to the exclusive pop. And there he is. It is. I gotta admit. It does feel a little cheap. Um, it is very light. And like I said, it feels a little cheap. I don't know if you heard. Put it back in there for a second. You can kind of hear. Let me see. You know, it is very hollow. And let me go ahead and bring it up on a better camera. But. There you go. That is <laughs> really cool. I do love this Batmobile design is the best. Of course, he is removable. You can see that. Uh, I got a little smudge on the windshield. <laughs> but it is pretty cool. Has a little holder for him inside. So it fits around his cape, which his cape is a little bit flexible. That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's the original with his blue gloves. And he even has a little, uh, let's see, see there, focus. He even has a little batarang in his hand. So that's really cool. There's actually some pretty good detail. It's got the thrusters in the back, which is really cool. It is a little simplified. Um, the Star Lord, Star Lord's uh, maneuver ship is a lot more detailed compared to this guy. So maybe that's why they included them uh, with this box series. <coughs> they probably didn't think may like it would have been good enough by itself. But it is really cool to see. <laughs> The Dorb's ride version of, you know, of Batman's car. I think that's really cool. And he can move his head back and forth because he was a little crooked. And there you go. Oops. So that's really cool. Fix my camera a little bit. Sorry about that. Should have checked it before. But um, yeah, this this guy I am very surprised about because everybody knew the pop that was going to be inside was and that's the Mr. Freeze and I do have uh, if you, you can see uh, in the background there I have the Batman animated series pops because those are some of the coolest pops and I had to get them all so this guy is going to be going right next to him and I might even buy a. S I haven't bought a second one of these boxes for a while. But man, I, this really makes me want to because <laughs> he's got his. I was, I was, I was wondering how they were gonna do the dome uh, for his suit, and they do it completely all the way around. It's not like just you know they paint on or anything like that. It's really. This is really cool. This is impressive because they usually don't. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, they usually don't do something like this. I mean, his suit is perfect. I mean, he, Mr. Freeze is perfect to be Funko sized, Funko Funko lized. <laughs> so it fits so well, and his it is really cool to see. You know, Mr. Freeze pop with his his original Mr. Freeze look from the anime series. Like I said, not the New Adventures of Batman. Uh, see, you know, rehash, redesign it is really cool. I gotta say, this is pretty cool box um, for DC. For the DC boxes, this is number one for sure. There is no other DC box I could think of that even comes that comes close to the, you know what's in here and of course there you go you can see the other characters so I have all six of course back there behind me but yeah I was very I'm I'm surprised uh, this is a, I mean for only having honestly two things which is the pop and then the doors because the comic is kind of a given um, and then the pen and the badge you know it's also a given to as well 
Uh, I guess the comic could be considered a third option, a third item, since the Star Wars ones don't have it, even though they do have comics. But as far as DC and Marvel, they always have a comic in it. And, I mean, the comic's pretty badass. <laughs> the Mr. Freeze pop is amazing. It is really impressive. Once you have them in your hands, to really see, you know, the detail and stuff that they put into it, it is really cool. Man, does it move? And his head does move. I was kind of worried that his, um, how his helmet was going to be, you know, separate from his head, so you wouldn't be able to move them both at the same time. But it looks like, yeah, the helmet is the part that is connected, and his head is connected to the helmet. And of course, you have the Batman Dorbs <laughs> ride, which that's just a complete shock, and that's really cool. Um, I do love that they're adding these Dorb rides into these boxes, and it makes me wonder what's going to be in the next DC villains because I gotta say, DC. Um, you know these Legion of Collectors boxes have gone, gotten so much better, so much better compared to the first year, and I'm happy because the value is so great now. Um, the Marvel ones have always been really solid um, to really great, but now DC is really stepping up their game. Uh, the Wonder Woman box was pretty good, but this one is just amazing. It's definitely recommend it if you can get this box set. I'm probably gonna buy two or three more of these. Um, I'll probably wait until uh, end of the year because they always have a special discount on them where they're only $15 each. So it ends up being like 22 bucks instead of like 35 bucks for shipping and taxes and everything. So that was really cool. Maybe I'll get some, pick some more up at uh, Kamikaze if they're there. But yeah, <laughs> it's, it's a really great box, gotta admit. And I'll have another unboxing of a League of Legends uh, mystery boxes that I got too as well. So if you're interested in that, keep an eye out for that video. It should be up right after this one when I'm done. So next box will be the Stan Lee box, which I am anticipating in about a week to two weeks I should be receiving that. Hopefully. Um, their shipping stuff is always weird, so I don't know what's up with that. But as far as the next Marvel one, Marvel, we're still about two months out. Same with DC. So... It's Star Wars. Star Wars should be coming up in about the next two weeks, I believe. I should have a Star Wars box. So until next time, guys. Later.